Good morning, everybody. What's good? I am back over here at the DeVore Estate. I finally got my um, my heated floor wire. Finally got the right amount. Um, I was sent the wrong amount the first time out, but that's okay. They uh, they made everything good. So if you see, if you can see, um, started right there coming out the wall. And we kind of kept it on threes, which is, you know, standard. That's where you want to be with it. So we brought it out of the wall there, ran it up toward the curb, then down that way. And you can see it picks up from there. So um, I've already started covering up. This thing is a little bit behind because of the wire situation. But you see it there, we run it down in threes, wrap it over, come back down the other way in threes. Go all the way down to the other end, wrap it, come back up, threes. So you're going to keep it on a three space. You want to keep it six away from your toilet flange on all sides. Uh, that would be six of those little dots is what I'm counting. I think I got five on one side, almost six on the other. But um, you want to leave that away from the toilet because you don't want to heat that toilet up because you don't want that water getting hot. That's going to make it stink even worse. You don't want it interacting with that, that cold tub or that cold um, toilet because it may cause, you know, it to crack, you know, with the floor heating up and then it cooling down, then it heating up because these little coils get, you know, fairly hot, hot enough to heat up the tile. You see over here, I don't know if you can see, I've got my stuff in here now, but we left off a little ways we left off a little ways there. That's going to be our leave out for where our uh, cabinet's going to go back. You see the sink is going to go there. So you got your vanity and stuff. So we brought it up uh, within five of the front toe kick, which is going to be located somewhere back there on that, um, on that leave out there for the, uh, For the vanity because you don't need to heat up underneath that that's just wasted heat then we rewrapped everything else you know right there it stops right in front of the closet so that's pretty much it um you step in you step up to that grab your towel walk back you're never going to walk inside that closet because it's just so small so i kind of stopped it right there at the door it's going to make for a great project but as of now I am just looking forward to getting this floor laid today. I may lay all the floor and then um, come back tomorrow morning and do the closet and get everything grouted up because that closet is just so small. You don't want to run the risk of uh, getting everything twisted right there at the door. So just try to keep everything straight and clean. Cleanliness is a must because you can't scrape the joints tomorrow due to the fact that there's wire down there. And the first time that that razor blade hits that wire, it's done. You got to tear it all up, redo it all over again. And that part comes out of your pocket. Pocket, excuse me. So, um, yeah, keep it clean. Keep your wire space appropriately so that the floor we heat correctly. And um, make sure it's flat because you can't tear a narrow piece of this back out. All right, those are your tips for the day. Peace.